Good morning, St. Thomas More. A couple of important reminders from guidance. First, we are extending the invitation to attend the Spring Pathways panel tour to all grade 11s and returning grade 12 students. Colleges from the Western Region, including Mohawk, Fanshawe, St. Clair, Lambton, Niagara, and Conestoga will be in attendance to discuss their programs, facilities, residents, financial aid, and so much more. Once again, this is an excellent opportunity to start planning for your post-secondary education, whether you are college or university bound. The presentation will be held on Monday, May the 13th from 9.30 to 10.30 in the library. If you are interested in attending, please sign up in the guidance office and pick up a permission slip, which you will need to get signed by your period two teacher. This will be your ticket into the event. Secondly, the Sergio and Angela Mancha fa uh, Family Graduation Scholarship is due next Friday, May the 17th by 3 p.m. sharp in the guidance office. Once again, this scholarship in the amount of $5,000 each will be awarded to a male and female student that is a first or second generation Canadian and demonstrates excellent leadership within and outside of the STM community. Please stop by the guidance office to pick up your application today if you haven't already done so. Have a great day, St. Thomas More. Good morning, STM. I'm here to talk to you about the Athlete of the Year nominations. This is a big time around here. Uh, huge school, tons of sports. So the Athlete of the Year is a big, big thing uh, at St. Thomas More. Letting you know the uh, nomination process is now open. Students, you can pick up a nomination form from either the Fazette office or the main office and nominate whoever you think um, should be nominated for the junior male, junior female, senior male, senior female athlete of the year. Uh, criteria, athletic ability, skill, leadership, sportsmanship, um, variety of things participated in at Thomas More. Um, this is a Thomas More award, not an outside of school award. Um, teachers, if you want to nominate anyone, you can just talk to um, Mr. Bonatatabis or Ms. Fermani and uh, have it done that way. But guys, if you feel someone should be nominated, please make sure you nominate them. Don't let somebody else or don't wait for somebody else to do it because it may not get done. You don't want to see somebody not get nominated because you didn't do it. So make sure you get that done. Nominations must be in no later than May 14th at 1 p.m. So please nominate whoever you think should be there and uh, Athlete of the Year will be decided at a future date. Thanks STM, let's make this happen. Good morning STM, my name is Shama and here are your announcements for today. This is a reminder to both the girls and boys touch football teams of our practice tomorrow after school. And now for your sports. The junior girls soccer team defeated the team from the creek in a 6-2 battle yesterday. The girls were trailing 1-0 after a PK in the first half, but managed to band together and take the win. With two goals each, Mira Tang and Matea Starkovich dominated the new men defense, while Gina Galliano and Jordan Boschman each contributed a goal. The girls are back at the scene next week as we take on CS and St. Mary's. Congrats, girls. Canadians of Asian heritage have helped build our great country. From constructing the railroad that connected us in the early days to serving our nation in both world wars and beyond. Canada's vibrant and diverse Asian heritage has influenced our country in so many areas. These contributions are important to our past, present, and will help shape Canada's future. May is Asian Heritage Month. Let's all celebrate. Good morning, STM. Uh, I'm here today with some great news. Yesterday, STM's Ultimate Frisbee team uh, went to the Catholic City Championships. Our team not only won the City Championships, but also won the Spirit Award, which is the uh, award for those uh, students who demonstrate superior skills, sportsmanship, and great character. Uh, we are very proud of this team. We are very happy to be going to GHAC. I would like to take a moment to thank both the, cap the captains of the team, uh, Stephen, Jeffrey, and Cynthia, as well as the administration and all the teachers for their patience. Uh, students are reminded, uh, especially players, that we are going to GHAC. Please be on the lookout for information and upcoming information about when we are going to be practicing, as well as forms and paperwork. 
Uh, congratulations to all the members of the team. We do appreciate it, all 24 of you. What a great job. It was a, a long, grueling day, and we appreciate all your effort and what you did for the school. Thank you. Hey STM, I'm Abraham. And I'm Young, and we're here for your Student Council announcements. Student Council election forums will be due May 13th to the main office with the election day being held on May 17th. Nominations for the senior superlatives are due May 13th. The winners will be featured in the yearbook with their winning categories. More information on how to submit your entry can be found on our recent Student Council Instagram post. Remember to follow our Instagram at STM underscore council for anything council related. Thanks, Thanks STM. STM. STM, those are all of your announcements. The time is now 8.23, and remember, it's a great...